chilling, my villains. It's your boy Skate Smeargle back again. And uh, today, people, today I bring you another week of PU battle, courtesy of DX Racer. Not really, but you know the sponsorship would be nice if you're looking out on the on the DX Racer tip. But um, uh, today, people, today I bring you a battle versus my man Blitz, and uh, he accepted this challenge as I accept challenges anywhere. You, you know, suplex, suplex, suplex. <laughs> anyway, let's go ahead and get into this battle. Um, using the same team as we used last time, and, uh, hopefully, uh, we can go ahead and pick up that W today. Um, he brings an interesting team, uh, because I rarely use any of these. Uh, I know Per Ugly is about to be a motherfucking problem. I know how fast it is. I know from experience. Um, do I have anything? Uh, d d d Singapore, let's check my right shoe. Evolog is obviously a spinner. Stuff Rock, Torterra. Uh, Grunt Pick is a special wall. Luxray, I have rarely see. So, um, what I'm going to actually do. Um, I'm thinking, um. I might just lead with Lick Leaky. Honestly. Actually, no. I can set up with Polyrath real quick. Actually, no. I can set up with Raichu. So. What I could do is uh, I think Lick Licky might be the key to this battle. Uh, as I think I know for a fact that Grumpy can spread Toxic around. Per Ugly is going to be a problem. That is a threat. That is a fat cat. That is that's fucking Garfield. I don't know how that motherfucker still moves. All right, but um, if you like what you see, go ahead and hit that like button. And I mean, it's not required, but it'd be greatly appreciated. Um. I'm not ask. I'm not really asking. It's just I'd rather, I'd rather see the, I'd rather gauge the, you know, how everybody likes this, man. I think everybody like what I've, what I've seen lately is that everybody likes Wi-Fi battles, and that's what I want to provide. But uh, let's see who's first. Obviously, he's oh shit, fake out. My question is, who's faster in this situation, right? You or pro ugly? Um. Uh, I'm just gonna for fake out. Yeah, fake out. God damn, that did a hell of a lot. So this thing's faster than me. I need to cripple this thing. Um, probably is going to be a huge, huge ass problem because I don't think I have really. I don't. Well, not really, because I still have uh, Polyrath in the back, now I think about it, for super effective hits. And I don't think it really can hit me for super effective hits on that. I know this thing has access to Giga Impact, which is devastating. Like, like to the point where uh, Jolly, Life or Per Ugly, Oko's, uh, Bold, uh, Max Defense, uh, Sylveon. And, and Sylveon, you know, is a bulky ass Pokemon. Like, oh my lord. Um. What this? I don't understand. Like. But he might predict me and actually. If he doesn't kill me. Um. He has one of two things. He can either switch to this part ugly again. And, uh, go for Torterra, which, uh, then the T would be killing pretty much. Uh. Rendered null and void. Um. Or he can stay. Yeah, I think he's gonna go out to Torterra. Ah. <laughs> okay, so this man is now uh, obvious thing is to go for. Uh, uh, what do I want to go out to? That's a good. Actually, I could go out to Swoobat. That's actually not a bad switch in. Um, I'm thinking he's not gonna want me to go out. To Torterra, well, I could go, um, I could go out to Torterra, <sighs> but, uh, let's see, I'm thinking he's just gonna get rocks up, yeah, <laughs> um, so I'm gonna go just go for Calm Mind, predicting the switch out. Yeah, it's since I'm simple. Grump pig. 
Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. And just go for the air slash. Oh, it goes for the T-Wave. Fuck. Um. Yeah. Luckily, I do carry the heal bell, so I'm not too worried about that. Um. Who do I want to go out to? What do I go out to? Nope. Staying in. Fuck it. I'm still faster. Ha 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 ha. Okay. Hmm. I could make a play. Damn! Subad just... <laughs> oh man. Oh man. Oh man. This is beautiful. I'm thinking he has nothing he wants to actually do to me. So what I'm going to do is I am... Well, U-turn kills it from this range. But, um... Fuck it. Nope. Ah, oh, the old classic whirlwind. So that's why I was going... Uh... This, this is, this is the wrong Pokemon to be switched out into. Because I can just go, uh, yeah. Them hands, though. You don't want to catch them hands. <laughs> um, so I'm just, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go for a substitute. Predicting the T-Wave. And, uh, oh. And that's a free, free, uh, um, sub. Bulky, bulky. I'm predicting the Kyra Ball. That's what I'm predicting right now, is the Kyra Ball. So, question, do I stay in? Yes, fuck it, bulk up. Predicting the Kyra Ball, Toxic, or... Yeah. And since I didn't attack it, it does not do it won't take that much damage. Yeah. So now this is a threat. This becomes a now bigger threat. Cause now after this I can just go circle throw. Bulky. <laughs> yeah. Which will hit for half effective damage, but it probably will break my sub. It does not break the sub! Oh, that is huge! Oh. Oh. Just go for waterfall. I know it's not going to hit for uh, super effective damage, but I'll take it. Flinch. Flinch. Yeah, this time I will break this up. Hmm. It's about time. Bulky. <laughs> Alright. I could just set up a sub here. Um, getting rid of his spinner, really. I'm thinking he wants to go for the, uh, either he's going to switch out. I'm surprised he doesn't run Gyro Ball on it. So. <laughs> Let's see what he wants to go for. I do believe, yeah. Bar and crit, this won't do nothing. Hmm. 
But I will circle the third thing out. Which... Hopefully he goes for Avalanche. Ha! Predicted! Does nothing to the sub. Yeah. That's a dead Avalog. Or not. Yeah. Get out. And now I can just start circle throwing it. Circle throwing everything. Singapore has done a mon I'm too, uh, too, uh, familiar with, really. Um. So I'm just gonna go for a circle throw. See, he goes grass knot. Okay. That's why I'm getting your bitch ass out. If I go back into Evelog, that is perfect. It's life for it, too. That's a dead Evelog. Oh, man. But that will allow him to get the free switch into anything. And, uh... I don't know. I'm a plus three polyrath. Um... Not a lot wants to come in. So, all this fake out is obvious. But now I have I can more assuredly deal with this polyrath threat. Yeah. But um Tartera now becomes uh pointless. Cause now I'm just gonna click circle throw on everything. He stays in, that's a dead per ugly. As much as I like per ugly, it is kind of frail. You turn. Okay. Does nothing. So the only two attacks I know from this part so far is, uh, um, you turn and fake out. Okay. And we're just gonna throw this bitch back back out. Look at the poly and it kills. Thank God. Look at the po grump the, the poly rep do work. That is what two three mons down now. No, that's two mons. We can have a log. Par ugly stuff fake out. Um, Tartaro is the real issue here, I guess. Uh, that's about it. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Polaris is like, you don't want to catch these hands. <laughs> Them hands, though. Honestly, why does Polaris look like it's fucking like the Hypnotoad from like Futurama, though? Real shit. If, if the, you know, uh, Hypnotoad from uh, Futurama was a uh, fucking big ass and a bulky ass motherfucker. Let's see what this man does. Um. Liger Zero. Interesting name. Oh, man. Question is Am I bulky enough to take a wild charge? Um. I'm gonna say yes. I got three bulk ups, and Paul Ref is not what you consider really frail in this tier, I guess. This is just, I think, really just to honestly threaten me out. But that Intimidate drop does kind of worry me. Ha! Huh. I guess he predicted me to switch out. Torterra. Uh, nope. Get your bitch ass out. He switches back into the, uh... <laughs> okay. Intimidate. Yeah. The whole point of this now is just to circle throw everything. I guess he predicted me to switch. <laughs> yeah, but I'm gonna eat this wild charge up, though. Yeah. Get your bitch ass out. Honestly, now I need the product to come in. Predictions! <laughs> uh, Alright. So, obviously, since this is the only super... Well, damn. I actually just looked at this team. Um... I guess now would be a good time to get rocks up. 
Um, check moves. Huh. So what do I have versus this, uh, this is lightning rod, the static. Um. Huh. <sighs> Where's the most, def okay. So I'm gonna switch into Armado. Predicting the fake out, but I'll take it well. Uh. <laughs> okay, so what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Well, that's the question. Um. First, I can go for this rapid spin, get these rocks down, knock off. Because I am super, I mean, I, uh, I can't remember the ability. Yeah. I needed those rocks gone. So what I'm going to do is I am going to stealth rock my own rocks. <laughs> Body slam. Fat ass. And I catch the para. Fuck you. But I'll still get my rocks out. Um, what I'm going to do is I am actually going to, uh, switch to my look like you probably hear in the turn of time, depending on what happens this turn. And I'm going to, uh, heal bell, uh, the T wave away from, uh, uh, the hell Pokemon is that? Um, Swoobat. Swoobat can take on Torterra because of Air Slash. Um, he stays in. Oh. And before it dies. Wow. Oh man, so I can't switch out, so I'm glad about that. And I'm gonna just art let Armado die here. And then I'm gonna go into, uh, I do believe, oh yeah. You will gain switch initiative though. I could have act, well no. Uh, so what does he want to switch into? I'm guessing, uh, since I really don't have an EQ user, I'm, he's gonna switch into um, Torterra. Well, he could switch into Luxray. Um, yeah, Torterra. This is actually a good thing. Because that will allow me to get a free switch in on, uh, um, Swalot. I'm gonna force the EQ. Yeah. I'm guessing he's gonna Ice Beam. Well, he's gonna set up rocks. And honestly, I, I, I'm, I, I can deal with rocks being up for the rest of the majority of the game. Unless he's smart and actually goes for the uh, EQ here. But then again, I don't know Swallow's actual base speed. If it's actually faster than a Torterra and Ice Beam, that is a dead Torterra. Um, and then that becomes problematic for him. Because that means I won't have rocks up on my team. Um, thankfully, uh, for me... Yeah. This, yeah. Oh, crit too! Oh, that's just insult to injury right there. <sighs> Alright. Torterra is now going to be a problem. Um, uh, so, yeah, I'm going to switch out to Lick Licky. <laughs> Alright. Let's go to... First of all, 
Hillbill. While well, he sets up rocks. <laughs> Which now, uh, since Grump Pick is gone, it's pretty much out there to stay. Yeah. Um, bar and crit, I should be able to take two more of these. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually wish... Mm. I said, bar and crit, look, look, we should live one of these. <laughs> Thank you, Torterra. I don't even care about rocks. But that is a deck for ugly on Switch, you know. Now I think about it. Um. Honestly, I can just go for the... Uh, no, I want to go for super effective damage here. So what I'm going to do is I'm switching to the, uh, the Swoobat. And, uh... And, uh... That's it. Predicting the EQ. Oh, thank God. Recoil. <laughs> it lived that. I'm so happy about that. Um, inbound air slash. I think that was the good. That was Avalug. Okay. Well, that's a dead Avalug. Ha! I'll take that. I think he just wanted to switch into uh, Pro Ugly, but I do believe that is a dead Pro Ugly. Upon switching. Oh, it lived! Oh! Question is now, what do you want to do? Yeah. God damn, that did a lot. Honestly, I can just click air slash. I think I actually, I think Swoobat just clutched this. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Because Tartara takes super effective damage. I get one flinch, and that's game. Ideally, he's down to his, uh, um, He's down to his Luxray, and he's down to his Torterra. Um, Subed is my win condition here. Subed is my win condition. But, um... Honestly, Luxray can kill itself from recoil. I, I'm willing to sack... Well, Pikachu can come in here and take a wild try because it doesn't hit... Uh, hmm. Yeah. Question. Luxury. What's so bad speed, though? Let's go ahead and look that up. Swoobat speed, I don't think it's actually pretty fast. Um, I know Luxray has a damn good speed. Um, one fourteen. That's actually pretty ridiculous. Um, so I'm just gonna air slash. Yeah. Crunch. And that's a dead Swoobat. Yeah. I think this thing is banded. That's what I'm thinking. 
Um. Yeah. Um. So honestly, I can just fake out and kill this thing. Now, Torterra becomes a problem. Um, I'm going to have to sack the Pikachu, the Pikachu off. I know this. Um, so what exactly is my plan here? Do I just... yeah. I need to, first of all, I need to go ahead and get this uh, theme leftovers off of it. I'm going to do this thing in three parts. I'm going to get leftovers. Alright. Sent it. Oh, shit. Okay. I can't touch this thing with this. Um. I don't know. I just lose here, don't I? If I can pass a wish off before this thing dies, I'll be happy. Now I kind of regret. As I said, uh, Torterra pretty much walls me. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually wish. Uh, I can't even do that. Okay. No, Torterra beats me. I can't do nothing about this. Uh, synthesis, rocks. Actually. Whoa. Uh. What hammer is. This thing is rock and. So I'm just circle throw. Is this in grass? Yeah. Yeah, Torterra wins this game for him. And the 3-1 comeback, man. I played that game perfectly. It's just that Torterra... I never had an answer for this being Torterra. Oh, man, that's actually kind of disappointing, man. Um. Yeah. Ain't no point in actually trying to just fake out. <laughs> yeah. But a uh, good game, man. I couldn't do nothing past the Tartaria. Yeah. As I said, Blitz, good game. And, uh, I guess what I still have to learn is that... I mean, I like this tier. This is actually a pretty fun tier. And the 3-1 comeback... I'm actually impressed. But, um, thank you guys. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video, and, uh, do.